So I said I was going to get out of bed early today. I lied. Why do I do this? Well, my dear, Nathan, it could have something to do with you going to bed at 2 o'clock in the morning. So we need to work on that before you begin to get up early. But still, that's... Oh, I don't know. 10 hours of sleep is a little much, don't you think? You need to work on that. Good morning, guys. It is Friday. Uh, thank God it's Friday. <laughs> but uh, I've had a lazy week so far, so with nursing this hamstring back. So I think my hamstring's about 90%, about 85 last night, so it's about 90 this morning. Uh, it's healed pretty quickly. Um, buddy, uh, uh, Steven, or Steve, I call him Steve, but, uh, said he was gonna be down here working out at ETSU for a little bit, uh, running some routes and whatnot. The ground's really wet, but um, it's gonna be wet tomorrow, so might as well run in it today and get some, uh, get some movement on this hamstring before tomorrow. I want to get sun today. Uh, I don't want to be completely just going out on a limb tomorrow and saying, hey, my hamstring's better. No, I want to run a little bit and make sure I know it's better before I drive all the way over there and get over there and not be able to run, but I'll still hang around even if I did. But I just want to get some movement in on this. I don't want to go hardcore sprints or anything. I just want to run some routes and uh, get, 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 my, get my feet under me to be just as a figure of speech. So let's just see what we can do. I'm not going to be down there long, probably an hour or so, and then maybe go hang out with Cousin Glenn and see how things go. So uh, yeah, let's go do this. And there's a 71 Camaro, it looks like. That's what it looked like at least. So, I don't know, something like that. I'm not really sure exactly what it was. But anyway, let's go run some routes. I'll see you guys in a few. Here it comes. Oh, it's a bear. Oh, you're a bear. <laughs> you are not a dog. <laughs> Why are you so excited? Because these people are new. That is a bear. <laughs> okay, we got a little bit, little wiener dog. Right here. What's this one's name? Dixie. Dixie. This is Dixie. Dixie. Tiny one, the little one, and then we've got Tucker, Tucker, Tucker. Then we've got the Great Pyrenees, who is six months old and is like the size of me, literally. Um, do you know how much he weighs? Brown would know, or Jenny yeah, one. That's my crutch. These two together are just a sock. This sounds like the smallest breed of dog versus the biggest breed of dog. Is he like the biggest breed of dog or is it St. Bernard? I would have to go with probably St. Bernard. It's kind of a tie. Well, I don't know. He might be a little bit bigger. He is literally a bear. <laughs> You're wet from girl. That's Tucker. <laughs> Tucker girl. Tucker tried to bite her. <laughs> Crystal like lay next to him. I can't lay, but I'll sit. Dixie. Dixie, I think Dixie likes to lick more than Tucker does. My legs. Longer, actually. Don't go between my legs. Please don't go between my legs. <laughs> 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 Where's your cat? Yeah, she's a big bear. Your ears, your ears, your ears, your ears. <laughs> you fix your ears. How do the dogs get along with cats? Good. I'm just 
trying to fix your ear, dude. She thinks you're playing. They I'm not playing. Every now and then, she'll chase one to the house. Tucker. Tucker. Okay, he's gonna tear that curtain down. <laughs> Can you ride Tucker? No. <laughs> I can <would> suggest it. <laughs> Tucker. Do you know Tucker can speak in the game? No. He'll sit Tucker. and speak. stuff my hamstring feels a little bit better but I went and did some shopping with Glenna and uh, well Crystal uh, Glenna's sister um, went to um, the movies her and I went shopping for a little bit and then we went and uh, I went to her house and we watched uh, the Green Mile and played Uno for played two games of Uno which lasted about two hours so now I'm back and we'll sit down and relax for a few minutes then probably go straight to bed so let's relax for a little bit watch maybe a couple YouTube videos and just chillax hey guys so finished watching the Boston Celtics game which they lost by two points because of a last second shot by one of the best shooters in the league which I'm not mad about that what I'm mad about is that we should have won the game one and two we had a big man guarding a little guy so yeah a big guy guarding a little guy just let that sink in you, people who don't know basketball say, well, that's a good thing. No, it's not, because the little guy's quicker. And the big guy just fumbles over his feet and doesn't really know what to do. That's why big men cover big men and little men cover little men. No, switching it up. That's why you don't have a little guy guarding a big guy right at the basket. He's going to turn around and just drop the ball in there. <laughs> you know, so it just, it doesn't work that way. But it's been a pretty good day nonetheless, so, um... I'm going to get some sleep. Hope you guys had a good day. So, good night, guys.